supplies everything on the list and some for the house so let's go through it real quick before open house if you are new to my channel I'm Kay Porsche thank you so much for watching if you are not subscribed go ahead hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell so you don't miss a post from me like 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 and comment on all videos it's an easy free way to help you girl out now let's get through these kindergarten essentials because today is open house and at aria's school since she is in kindergarten they have open house on today from 5 p.m to 7 p.m and basically we just meet the teacher we introduce aria to her teacher and get her ready for the first day her first day is in two days so today is tuesday her first day is thursday so she will meet the teacher. She'll get to drop off all her school supplies so we don't have to bring it on the first day, which is great because like the first day is always just super busy and stuff like that. So I'm glad that we get to go ahead and drop it off early. Aria is not new to school because she has been attending pre-K programs since she was two years old. So she is not new to school. Um, we don't think she'll have any issues, but this is a bigger school. So, you know, it will take some getting used to. But are you subscribed? What you waiting on? What are you doing? Because you're obviously doing nothing. So I did allow Aria to pick her own backpack and tote, lunch bag rather, and she picked this off of Amazon. So it's this cute purple bag. Her favorite color is purple and it came with this little tote. And because this tote is not really like large, I don't think it's big enough to put her lunch in it. And plus it doesn't zip. So I bought her a lunchbox as well. She picked this lunchbox from Walmart. I will try to link it. I doubt that I'll be able to, but I will look and see if it's online to link. I will link her backpack and now it's super cute guys. I love it. It's literally the perfect kindergarten backpack. So it has this huge pocket. Then it has this little compartment and it has two compartments in there and a little small one here too as well as this little flap in the front with another zipper for her pencils and smaller things like that so i absolutely adore this backpack i'm so glad she picked this one because it's just beautiful guys now i did get her the larger size backpack so on amazon you'll see the option to get a small one and a large one i got the larger one um, after reading the reviews i just felt like she would need the one with more space so she can use it you know for as long as she wants and it came with this tote i don't think the smaller one comes with this tote so keep that in mind if you're interested in this if you know you know no lunch is complete without a bento box. I'm so excited to finally be able to use 
a bento box. I'm not gonna open it because I want it to be brand new for her first day of school. It's super cute though. I will post in another video her chore chart and her lunch for the first week. So be on the lookout for that and I'll show you all her bento box as well. I hope I'm pronouncing this right. See, I'm trying to be bougie. Don't even know how to pronounce it, but it gotta be bento. It's B-E-N-T-O, bento, yeah. Yeah, that's how you pronounce it. So um, it has the fork and the spoon on top. Super cute. I'm super excited to begin to send her lunch to school, pack her lunch every day, and just try different things with that because at her previous school, she has just, you know, eaten the lunch that was there. Really didn't eat too much anyway. So I just let her eat the lunch that they have there and then she eat when she gets home. So I also bought these reusable ice packs so they are i'll show these in another video as well more in detail but they are shaped like little unicorns and they come in four different colors so these are super cute i got this and the bento box from amazon why did i send my husband to get some wipes and he came back with these i ain't saying nothing wrong with you know, Walmart brand, but I was just thinking Pampers. I mean, it's... don't be hating. <laughs> don't be hating. Y'all. They gonna get the job. No. I was just thinking, you know, it's the first day of kindergarten. We can take some Pampers yeah. white. And show them fifty-eight cent paper towels. I got a deal on too. <laughs> yeah. Hey y'all. So, he, he, he ain't shame at all. This man went and got just paper towels. This don't say shit, but paper towels. Like what? Yeah, what? Nothing. Ghetto. 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 All right. In all seriousness, like, I'm cool with the Parents Choice Wipes. I just prefer these because these are the ones that I use at home. So I just prefer us to send things that we use at home personally. So I know that it's good. We won't have any problems with it. Yeah, I don't use Parents Choice, never have. So I'm not sure if it's good or, or what. So I don't have any problem with these. I've just never used them. On the school supply list, all kids must have a mat. And this one specifically is what they ask for. Now, I was under the impression that in kindergarten and up, you no longer take naps, but you still take naps. So here we are with the mat. And you know, I'm just asking them, like, do y'all still take naps? Because, hmm. Ziploc bag. First it was just COVID. Now it's the monkey pox, the chicken pox, all kind of pox. So we got Lysol, wipes, and the spray, period. We got the big size because, yeah. We got the ultra soft Kleenex. Her school supply list was very specific, y'all. So, they asked for this primary journal. So, I'm used to the old school composition book, like the black and white one with the full notebook paper. No, ma'am. Her school asked for this one, where it's like room to draw at the top and then lines at the bottom. I thought this was super cute and I had never seen it before. I guess because, you know, this is my first child, but I had never seen a composition book like that before. And I went to three different stores to look for it. So if you are looking for this composition book, guys, I got it from Knowledge Tree. I'm not sure if you have a Knowledge Tree where you are, but I know for sure they will have this. They asked for the folder with the three prongs and the two pockets. So I got three of these and then i got her a folder to keep at home also because her last school used this folder and i absolutely loved it because it has a, a pocket that says left at home and then bring right back to school and i just bought her some extra pencils for her homework projects and things like that never have too many pencils and they are the big kindergarten pencils so we love these and it makes it super easy for her to write and hold the pencil i wasn't sure if her teacher preferred them to all share the supplies or give each child the supplies that their parents bought i was referring to the things like this play-doh because i got four pack of play-doh 
and then they ask for 24 glue sticks. So I am pretty certain that one child is not using 24 glue sticks. So I believe they are sharing, which is completely fine. And they also ask for watercolor, of course, as well as a 12 pack of the kindergarten pencils. Of course, we got the 10 pack of washable markers. I believe they asked for the eight pack, but I could only find the 10 pack. I've never even seen an eight pack of markers. I don't know. Well, I don't remember seeing an eight pack of markers. So we got the 10. Oh, well, every color is in there. As well as four boxes of 24 pack Crayola crayons. They also asked for two of these clear window pouches, as well as the Friscar blunt cut scissors. So these will be for school and these will be for home because these are the blunt cut ones. Whereas these are the pointed tip ones. And the last thing that I have are extra clothes. So I will not be taking these up to the school on today. I'll more than likely have them in her backpack, you know, just in case she has an accident, which she never does. But just in case, I have these cute little pants and a regular black t-shirt, as well as these cute little jeggings and a basic t-shirt as well. So I'll put extra socks, underwear, t-shirts, and this long sleeve shirt and long sleeve pants in her bag. And this will stay in her bag at all times, you know, just in case of an emergency. That is all that I have for the kindergarten essentials. I cannot believe that I have a five-year-old going to kindergarten. It's just like unbelievable. And I'm so proud of my daughter. I'm so excited to go on this journey with her and period is up from here so on break my heart say you love me again undo this hurt that you cause well i think i forgot the words but y'all know what i was trying to say man, I don't let her talk about that noise y'all man look them parents' choice wipes and 58 cent, man, paper towels gonna get the job done. That's what y'all don't realize. See, y'all just be looking at names. <laughs> just because it just said paper towels, I mean, that don't mean nothing. It's paper towels. That's why I got it. They said paper towels. And it was a deal. So I bought about five of them for the house. That's what she don't know. I just put one of them junks, you know what I'm saying, on the paper towel holder. She ain't even know. So. That's what she don't know, is that we be using the 58 cent paper towel. Daddy, I heard the oh, doorbell. My bad. <laughs> what you got? What you got for your teacher? Okay. You made that? That's so cute, girl. <laughs> Let's get your school supplies out. Who is hot? Your dad is so damn country. Look at his <laughs> country as hell. Look at these socks. Don't <laughs> be hating on me, bro. She got. <laughs> It's so cool. Take a picture. Oh, let them back. Oh. My girl flying in the kindergarten. Look at the big girl. Are you going to get this one? <laughs> <laughs> Is it so cool in there? Stay sick. What hallway you on? What color hallway you on? Red. Oh, well, hold on, hold on. What color table you on? Red. <laughs> Baby, yeah. I, I, ain't gonna, I ain't gonna lie to you. Mommy and daddy sure is proud of you. Let me find out you finna cry. Man, what's going on, man? Come on. <laughs> Mommy got no friends. Right, Turn around again. Let me see your backpack. Okay, girl. <laughs> All right, let's go. Ready? Let's go. Ready? Let's go. Ready? Let's go. First day of school? Yeah! You ready to get on in there? Yeah! <laughs> and you lost the tooth last night. <laughs> Man, you just going on up. <laughs> Not last night. Um, morning. Oh, okay. 
I left it earlier. I can't wait to hear about your first day today. I can't wait to hear about your first day. Oh, my first day. <laughs> look, look, she she mad because they done wrote something on her hand. <laughs> she mad because her... She all dressed up, her mama done sprayed some Gucci perfume on it. Now she mad because they wrote something on her hand. <laughs> that, I'm that, not mad. That'll mess her day up already. <laughs> she asked the lady, can, can I wash this off? 